I just want to get back to the hotel in Israel. You make it to Tel Aviv, to Jerusalem, doesn't matter where. And you make it back to the hotel and you order a doctor. A uh, doctor comes to your room. He's wearing Birkenstocks and, and shorts. He kind of looks like Steven Spielberg's brother. Not like Spielberg, but kind of like him. He's a beard. Very, very nice man. He's like, okay, okay, okay. How are you? How are you? Well, I don't feel so good. Really? Your stomach? What is it? Your stomach? Yeah, it's a little queasy. Oh, are you like, are you nauseated? Well, not exactly nauseated. It's like I'm kind of nauseated, but not really nauseated. Do you have a headache? Not exactly. It's like I almost want to have a headache, but I don't really have a headache. You know what I'm saying? It's, like, it's kind of halfway distance between being that and having a headache. It's, are you queasy? Well, not really queasy. You know? Are you Jewish? <laughs> Number seven, Holland to France through Belgium. You're in Amsterdam in the red light district where there are these women selling themselves in little windows with red fluorescent lights. You've just passed the African zone where there's African women, and then you've gone past the Scandinavian zone where they're mostly blonde, there's brunette zones, and right now you're in front of the Asian zone. As you look at the Asian women in the red light district in Amsterdam, on closer inspection, you realize probably half of them are actually men. <laughs> station bathroom at the Amsterdam bus station. You're washing your face, you look up and you see you look like a ghost and then you notice all around you that all the lights are fluorescent blue. Why are they fluorescent blue? And then you notice you can't see any of your veins. <laughs> well, these lights are there so you can't shoot up heroin in this bathroom. Gosh, what a pity. <laughs> On the bus to France. On the bus, passport, passport, pas de problème, pas de problème. Passport, passport, bon on est là, passport, passport, passport. Ah oui, 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 pas de problème, ça va, ça va. Passport, passport, ah oui, 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 pas de problème, pas de problème, passeport. Ah, américain, américain, qu'est-ce que tu fais ici? Ah, tu fais, ah, j'aime le. Ah, Holland, Amsterdam, Amsterdam, ah, Amsterdam, <laughs> Philippe, deux Américains, allons-y, allons-y, uh, please, come with me. Now, you travel to Amsterdam with your brother, who has dreadlocks and hasn't taken a shower in five days. <laughs> You're pulled off the bus and taken into a strange room where all your bags are searched, every suitcase, every pocket, all your books. And then you're taken into a little room and asked to quitter les chemises, which means take off your shirt. Take off your shirt. Okay, ça va. S'il vous plaît, quittez sous pantalon. You are with a very angry glare, regretting that the Allies saved France from the Nazis. Drop your pants. Ooh. Ah, pourquoi mes pas douche? Why you don't take a shower? No, rien ici, rien ici, rien. Pas de problème, ça va. They found nothing to great disappointment and let you get back on the bus. <laughs> 